This is the second episode of Versus video series. This is the Warzone Stick Show. Our channel will now be an IT fighting arena. We're gonna make them fight till death. And here is the situation. If you are preparing for CCNA or Cisco Certified Network Associate, and let's say you only have limited time and you need to choose just one CCNA course. In the blue corner, we have David Bombal CCNA. And the red corner, we have Neil Anderson CCNA. For those who are new to this channel, welcome. I am your host. Name is Dean Armada, and I'm the Cloud and Data Center. And on this channel, we talk about tech careers and certifications, trivia and tutorials in cybersecurity, trivia and tutorials in cloud and data center, and my journey as an IT instructor. So feel free to check out the rest of the channel and consider subscribing. Now, how do we know which one is better? Well, I have a very simple approach. We will just use search engine. So we will just Google Neil Anderson versus David Bombal's CCNA. Okay, and this is Reddit. Um, we don't need to add CCNA. It will appear um, many different David Bombal's versus CCNA from the search result. Okay, and these are all Reddit. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open the top four. Uh, this one is David Bombals versus Jeremy versus Niels. No, we don't care about Jeremy. We don't care about their threesome. Sorry. This is not for triple threat. Okay, it's just a duo. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to skip that. And uh, I will also select these. And this one. Udemy CCNA. David versus Neil. All right. So... Let's look at the results. So this is a year ago. And uh, yeah, so this guy posted, I'm about to start studying CCNA and I need help with course, which one should I choose? So let's look at Neil's course is direct and precise while David's course is deep and informative. Okay. I like both of them, but I think I would recommend one over the other. I'd say Neil Anderson. Okay. What else? Have you considered giving Jeremy IT? Well, we don't care about Jeremy. All right, Neil did it for me. Just started Neil's course yesterday on Udemy and it's great so far. Okay, it says Neil Anderson. Neil, I did Neil. There seems to be more structures in learning than David Bombal. Neil all day, brother. Right now, I'm on my CCNP path, but while studying for CCNA, I took David's course. Okay, I started studying about a week ago using David Bombal's on Udemy. Will not jump on Neil's because I don't want to burden myself. Okay, David, I've seen some weird off topic question from Neil's student. Okay, and what else? Uh, thanks for your input. I have both course and I cross reference the chapter I struggle with. I think that more resource you have, the greater your chance will be. Right, all right. So, second post CCNA, who used David Bumbles or Neil Anderson's? Okay, here's the thing. I keep seeing questions like this on the sub over and over. I should uh, sample all the instructions. Yep, all of them. Everyone learns in different ways. It, everyone connects with different instructors. Yeah, 100% correct. Hey, and Neil Anderson replied to this guy's comment. All right, so Fl Flockbox TV, this is Neil. I couldn't have said this any better. Great comment, thanks. And he followed up with his own comment. Thanks for the kind words about my course, everyone. I'd love to say, yeah, my course is the best, but it's not the network's comment is spot. It's best to check out different instructors and go with one who best fits you your learning style. Man, this guy is very humble, okay? He can just say, yeah, my course is the best. Don't purchase David Bombals. Don't purchase Sharing My IT's lab. You are wasting your time and money. But no, uh, it's just like saying, yeah, um, uh, purchase other instructor CCNA course as well. He also advised here, all of the top instructors are CCIEs with many years of training experience, just like yours truly. 
All right. Um, I recommend Neil Anderson. Okay, both are good. Bombal strays a bit more from the exam materials, but goes into more detail. Anderson's course is very concise and to the point. Okay, you cannot use single course and pass. You will never. Um, I, I totally disagree with you. I really believe uh, one course is enough. Okay, I use both plus OCG. Pick one and pair it with Boston. All right, let's go to the next one. Which course is best on Udemy? Neil or David? The answer is drum roll, both. Ah, I don't like the answer both because we have limited time. All right, I'm finishing up with Neil's Anderson's. Excuse me, Neil Anderson's course today, and honestly, loved it. He kept it light, fun, and most importantly of all, informative. Okay, uh, Niels recommends something called Alpha Prep. Yeah, this is like the exam practices. I like Niels more. I couldn't stand David Bombal's voice for some reason. I like Bombal. Niels' accent is too strong and I can't really concentrate on the material. Okay, maybe it's because I'm American, but I think his accent and slight list is charming. Oh, Neil. You are charming. If you can get both, get both. If you have to pick one, that's hard one. Mm. Look them up on YouTube and pick which one you feel uh, better about. Okay. I like Bill. Who the hell is Bill? I have both. But yeah, accent is very strong. But I just look at the material and learn best way possible. Okay, Todd Lumley, no. Now, Tom Lonely is actually out of the picture. Okay, next next post. Uh, Udemy CCNA, Neil Anderson versus David Bombals. Any thoughts? Main differences I have noticed is Bombal is 80 hours and Anderson is 40 hours. Yeah, that's kind of big difference. Like uh, double the difference, 40 and 80 hours. I guess so Bombal course is 80 hour bomb. Bombal talks pretty slow too. That's why... Uh, it went 80 hours. You're right about that. Bombal is more precise and in-depth. I've been watching both. Bombal goes into uh, depth using Warshark a lot. Uh, but for now, I want to pass CCNA. I've been sticking with Neil Anderson. I have both. I would say both. Ah, you're so boring. Both is not an acceptable answer. I don't think you can go wrong either way. Anderson. I haven't used Anderson, but I passed using Bombals. You don't see them either or. All right, here's interesting. Neil Anderson commented on other posts just like this one while back in the subreddit. He said he admires Bombal very much and suggested the, the, the people to buy both his and Bombal's course. This guy's very humble. I can't believe it. All right, I have only used Neil Anderson's course, but can you... Uh, but can give you an unbiased review. He speaks slowly and clearly, which allows you to totally enjoy the content. So for 90% of the course, he provides as much informa information as you need to understand the concepts. All right, and yeah, we're done. Um, do we have more? I think we have more posts. Uh, 21, 2020. Um, all right, this is very interesting. Has anyone else struggled through David Bombal's course? <laughs> Let's open this. All right. I did David Bombal's and found all right. David is amazing, but if you do not like his style, Neil Anderson is 10 out of 10. David is brilliant, but he's not great at breaking down what he's doing and will speed through the times without explanation, really. Uh, there's just some teachers you won't gel with no matter how good they are. All right. I believe David's serial on Udemy itself is a bit messed up. Check out Keith Parker. David sounds like reading a book. All right. Personally, I think Jeremy did it. Awesome. Well, we don't care about Jeremy. David Bombles has great content, but his voice is so robotic and boring. For me, it's been Jeremy's videos. I've been trying as well. Okay, this Lamley. I recommend going with Neil Anderson's to get basic understanding. Okay, I tried it and don't fancy his style. He also seems to jump around the place too much. 
I like David Bumble's course on Udemy and have already gone through Neil's course too. I quite like Kevin Wallace, bought David and Neil Udemy course and miserably failed. If you're learning from scratch, the Cisco Net Acad free course are the best option. Reddit done. Next, we'll go to Udemy and check the two courses. So I will go to udemy.com and uh, we're gonna search. Very simple, just CCNA. That's it. And look at the result. Oh, the first one is Neil Anderson. And I'm gonna open this to a new tab. And the second one, oh, this is David Bumble. Okay, and I'm gonna open this also in a dedicated tab. And let's check out. So this, both are bestseller, as you can see, bestseller, bestseller. And Neil Anderson has a rating of 4.8, while David Bumble is only 4.6. But let's look at the rating. So what I'm going to do is I will scroll down and I will, I will, uh, yeah. Th so these are the ratings or, or the reviews. So 4.8, 50,000 plus ratings. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click show all review. I will do this also with David Bombals. <clears throat> so I'm going to click show all reviews. There you go. <coughs> Excuse me. So. As you can see here, this is a mix of five star, four star, and even one star. How many five star Neil Anderson got? It's 75%. Uh, the one star rating is less than 1%. Let's compare it to David Bombals. For David Bombals, it's only 63% five star and 1% one star. So let's check and compare the five star. Very well organized. This is for Neil Anderson. Well organized. I have taken many technical video training courses and uh, used such trainings to pass five certifications. This one is as good or better than any I have experienced today. All right, excellent course. Just took my CCNA exam and passed on the first try. If you dedicate yourself to learning, Okay, so cheers, your accent and pronunciation of words kept me entertained for hours. Great course, I passed today 9%. So obviously all the five ratings, uh, all of the five ratings, these are very positive. Okay, and uh, uh, Neil Anderson Udemy course uh, definitely have a much five-star rating than David Bombals. Let, let's check out David Bombals. The course is very comprehensive. I'm non-technical in computer networks. David narrated and explained the contents nicely. The course brings so much valuable content. The course is useful for beginner network engineering. Uh, we live in incredible times. We live in incredible times, excuse me, have learned a good knowledge, very enriching experience, good value for money, brilliant as software developer. All right, so these are all five ratings. So expected all positive feedbacks. Now, I'm curious what people would say uh, for those who provided one star rating. So this is for Neil Anderson. So very cool presentation. My main interest is doing this course was to get reasonable explanation and background. And uh, essentially doing this course is just watching a talking head superimposed on masses of terminal text. Uh, he literally just sits there and reads the slides. Even when I finish some lecture, it doesn't appear the check mark in some of them. It's frustrating. I don't understand why every course feels the need to go million miles a minute. Neil just says things and doesn't explain what it is or how it works. All right, uh, his test banking program that he's part of doesn't let you cancel on this. All right, I think this is more of a Udemy or Axis. Yeah, um, this is actually not on Neil's uh, course or related to the course. My video is not working. Again, this is Udemy or access related issue. Was expecting detailed explanation and pointer when it comes number and diagram. Can't understand much. Poor explaining and very disorganized. Hard to follow. Yes, there is information, but it's not a cluster F to find the order and application of it all. Video doesn't work for some videos. Not so impressive. The sound is not okay. Anyway, so some of the comments here is related to access and Udemy platform. Let's check 
David Bombal's one star ratings. The course, oh no, this one. I'm, I have to click this one star. Although the instructor has incredible knowledge about networking, this course is overall very messy and not structured. Subnetting labs are confusing and difficult to understand. I was happy in the beginning, but first, it is not structured at all. He recommended packet tracer for the labs and somehow from one point, he switched most labs to GNS3. I'm a pen tester with knowledge and understanding of networks, yet I'm unable to comprehend that this organized material. The course is not well structured and it has no lecture notes. The course gives you exercises it didn't teach you and it's CCNA material. Too much preparation before going to the, mat to the matters. The teacher over explains simple concepts then completely avoid more complex ones. The most poorly structured course, not all suitable for beginners. The course is not sequential. The topic jump around and even include YouTube videos supposedly to teach key topics. Sometimes it, it looks like the professor just got all of his existing videos and put it all together without any order. Need better explanations, too long, needs real world examples. So, who won? I think it's a little close. But Neil Anderson CCNA is, I believe, the winner. From Reddit, both instructors received positive comments. But in Udemy, Neil Anderson CCNAs ranks the first from search results, with an average rating of 4.8, while David Bombles comes second with an average rating of 4.6. And from the reviews, student consistently advised David Bombo's course is messy and poorly structured. So, what do you think of this series? Feel free to give suggestions and opinions. And don't forget to hit the like button.